It is quarter till six. Spokane seniors will graduate in an in-person ceremony this year, and it'll be outside at the Riverfront Pavilion. Yeah, but due to capacity limits, each student will only be allowed to invite a certain number of guests. Destiny Richards is live at the pavilion right now with the details. Graduation ceremonies are happening here at the pavilion this upcoming weekend, but even with an outdoor ceremony, Spokane Public Schools is following both state and local health guidance to make sure everyone is safe. Now again, graduates should have already received two wristbands for two guests to attend their ceremony, and each ceremony will have two seating areas, a general seating area and a vaccinated one. In general seating, guests will sit in pairs that are six feet apart from other guests. This seating area is open to vaccinated and unvaccinated vaccinated guests in the designated vaccinated seating area. No social distancing or masks will be required. This week, graduates will have the opportunity to exchange their two guest wristbands for four, as long as all four guests are fully vaccinated. Those guests should be ready to provide proof of being fully vaccinated for at least two weeks prior to the graduation ceremony. And ahead of this weekend, SBS says all guests should be prepared for the warm weather and a lot of walking. For those who don't want to park downtown, parking will be available at North Central High School with shuttles running to the pavilion area. And all of that can be uh, communicated by the graduate to their school leaders to set up. Uh, we obviously want them to dress comfortably. It's not a formal uh, affair, much like uh, we traditionally do. And, uh, you know, wear comfortable shoes for walking. Um, we're expecting a beautiful day. We're expecting a celebration. It's going to be a wonderful weekend. Now that you're coming to the now that you know you're coming to the pavilion, this is a couple of things that you'll need to bring. You can have a blanket or a beach towel. You can also have one of those really low to the ground beach chairs. You can also have a plastic water bottle, a reusable one, and then yes, a mask. In order to get into the pavilion, you are required to have a mask. But if you're in that vaccinated area, you can take it off once you're in. You can also bring an umbrella, poncho preferred, um, as well as baby bottles, formula if you need that. Um, but even though it's outside, it's not a football game. So no noisemakers, big signs, or any of that. Now we have more information and all those graduation dates to share with you. That is in this story now on KXLY.com. Live at the Pavilion, Destiny Richards, 4 News Now.